Today is going to be an amazing show because we got special people with us in the house. And yes, I'm talking about special because these guys have made a mark in their industry. Now, let me do the introductions on Danny quickly. Now, Levi Chikere is a fast rising star in the entertainment industry, known for his dual talent as both an actor and a musician, uh, making his mark with his debut in the movie Blood Vessel. Now, Levi uh, garnered widespread attention and earned his first nominations at the African Magic Viewers Choice Awards. You know what? He's not the only guest we're having on the show. David Ezekiel is a versatile actor known for his ability to bring characters to life mm. and convey messages effectively through his craft. With a decade of experience on stage and five years on screen, he has portrayed a diverse range of roles. Ezekiel recently starred as Abby in the Netflix original film Blood Vessel, earning him a nomination for Best Actor in a Lead Role at the 10th edition of the NBCAs. Should we bring them in? Let's bring our guests. Guys, <laughs> A round of applause, guys. Guys, guys, thank you for joining us. Hey. Yeah, you're looking fresh. <laughs> sharp, sharp. Thank <laughs> thanks, good. thanks, guys, for coming out. We appreciate thank your you. time. Thank yes, you. yes. When thanks, we guys. start, we have to say congratulations. Yes. I mean, like, first thing, we caught up, of course. I did see you at the, at the yeah, event. Yes, um, and you both looked absolutely stunning. We didn't talk, <laughs> but you, you know. How did it feel not only being nominated among the greats, but also being able to sit down among them? You know, you, you. <laughs> it was, it was, I would say, one of the best experiences of my career yet. Yes. Okay. Because, you know, you, you've watched these people growing up, you've seen their stuff, you've mm -hmm. learned from them, yeah. and you get to have a conversation with them. It's just the best experience. Hmm. I like that. I like that. The fact that you said you, you watched these people growing up, you've seen their stuff, yeah. and you are in the same place making magic yeah. happen. Now, yeah. Truthfully now, tell us, were you at any, or were you guys at any point tense to be like, ah, oh my God. I'm working with this man? <laughs> or maybe they saw someone, they were like, oh my God. Uh -huh. did, did that ever happen? So definitely, you're going to feel tense at some point. You'll be like, yo, this is someone I've always watched. Yeah. Yeah. I get to do something with you uh -huh. up close. I get to be in the same category yeah. with you. It's really beautiful. Hmm. Like, you just feel a little bit of... And then, there. and then sometimes you don't just know what to say. You're like, oh my God, <laughs> let me not go and mess up. So you don't say the wrong thing. And so you, you're just greeting them. You, you're telling them how much of an impact they've had on your own career mm -hmm. and explaining to them that, you know, they're in some way part of the reason why, mm. you know, you're there. And, and it, it just feels so good to, to be amongst them it's it just it such is. a good experience you know what you both did a fantastic job on blood vessel you, um it was you. netflix top 10 for two weeks yeah. yes. Yes. which is incredible and it also secured six nominations at the mvc yeah. yeah. including for best film and best director yeah. did you did you predict <laughs> all this when you were walking on the project did you anticipate or predict that this was going to happen yeah. I, Go, okay, no, I didn't, go ahead. Anyone, I didn't honestly. think anything going on that project i was just excited to be on that project number one because mm. that was my debut that was my first big movie yeah. so i was really excited so at the nominations i was just looking i was like yo let's just let blood vessel let us just do something there yeah. let's just yeah. get on be nominated for the mvca mm -hmm. and lo and behold i see my name there i'm like <laughs> oh thank you god it was just so beautiful yes for me. it was it was, indeed, it was, indeed it was you know because you're, you're filming and you you know there's something that happens you're creating and mm. The moment it leaves your hand, it's out of your hand. True. There's nothing you can do. You know, the audience perception of, of that mm -hmm. totally mm -hmm. changes. You can't predict that. Mm -hmm. But, you know, it, it, it came out and it did really well. I mean, being number one for two weeks consecutively for yeah. a non-English film globally. It was, it was no, amazing. that it was, it was a good, very good experience. Very, very it was good. amazing. It was and amazing. Then eight, and then six nominations, come on. Come on, Six nominations, oh. it's like, it's come, on. Come, on. Like, come on, come on, guys, come on, guys. Okay, now, let's, since, since we're talking about blood vessels, because, you know, let's, let's focus on that project now. Yeah. Let's see how, how much, because that was a huge movie, looking at the reviews and what people had to say um, mm -hmm. about it. Now, let's talk about the, 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 the technical part of it, because as actors, the, there is a lot expected from you yeah. to bring to the table. Yeah. Was there any point while you were filming and you felt that, I didn't do enough. I don't, I don't think that was the best I could do. Well, did that ever happen? I didn't think it was the fact that I didn't do enough. It just, it was a very challenging role because playing Degbert was very challenging. Mm. 
growing up, I didn't know how to speak Pidgin English. I grew up in Port Harcourt. Oh. And Port Harcourt, we have a particular Pidgin English. A, so a kind of Pidgin English. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> my mom was a broadcaster for many years. So in my house, it was just English and Igbo. Mm. So playing that character was is a complete opposite of who I am. Oh. That's a very rough character. I think the only thing I have in common with that character is being hyperactive. Mm -hmm. Apart from that, that's a totally different character. Yeah. So I had to dig deep into the Potako Pigeon English yeah. to get as raz as possible. <laughs> I just had to soak myself in that character. Mm -hmm. So playing that character, was it was really beautiful. Yeah. It was really I'll, beautiful. I'll, I'll piggyback off him. Yeah. Um, same, my mom, too, you know, she was, she was a teacher back in her day. Mm -hmm. And you would, you would not want to be called speaking Pigeon in the house. Wow. You know, it's English, you know, and um, for years, that was it. But then getting this role, I had to shed David mm. as a person, you know, to just get into this character. And it was exciting as it was challenging. Mm. Mm. Yes. Because you do not, you do not have an idea of what you're getting into. Yeah. And then you see the script, yeah. and then you read the script, and you're like, this oh is not God. me. How am I going to do this? How am I going to do this? Like, <laughs> to <laughs> to this? Just, you need to you know? come alive. And, hmm. and then you, 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 you think of every single thing and bring out every single training you have as an actor yeah. mm -hmm. and put it into this film, put every it into this particular film. character everything. so that you, you have the best. Mm -hmm. And for me, the, um, the language, speaking mm. in your, was it was the Learning highlight the language, of oh making goodness. this film so it was, because I, I had to speak a totally different language. language. Boy, how, how long did it take to learn that? Because okay, so we, we actually didn't have enough time yeah, to we learn the language on set. On set. No. We were learning oh, really, right yeah, we were learning language. right on set. set. <laughs> so we finish um, the scenes for a particular day. We go back to our rooms and, <laughs> and we're yeah, learning the language for the next day. Wow, <laughs> that was how it was. Wow. Even although it started off um, a bit strenuous at first. Yeah. Going into it, we started. We got a hang of it. Yes. It, be it became exciting. Yeah. We're like, oh, we're speaking a different language. <laughs> That's what it is. Because I believe that as actors, we're blank canvases. Okay. And so you you should be able to take on any paint. Take yes. on anything. Take yes. on any paint and bring out the beauty exactly. of it. Exactly. You know what? Beautiful. I, I don't want our, our viewers, not who haven't seen the trailer or seen the film, mm -hmm. not to get a little bit of what went down and the incredible work that you both did. So you know what? Let's watch it and we'll come back, of course, and still have this conversation. Yes. Fantastic work. <laughs> The youths of Nimbi were out protesting the oil spillage in the community. Me? I'm a lover boy. Not a fighter. I was out there professing my love for Uyo. And protecting her. Some of the youths were more daring than others. But all of us are about to suffer for their actions. Captain Kudos, start the engine. This is the Ghana Navy. Stop now. If anything happened to her, I need it. And this is my ship. Absolutely incredible job. If Shout you're watching out. that, then you, <laughs> then you need to go see it. In fact, if you haven't seen it, if you haven't seen it, you know what? That's the reason why it had six nominations, okay? You know what? The AMVCs were big, and in case you didn't see any parts of it, of course, our very own Jadel was live in the red carpet, and we do have some of the action yes. that went down. Let's yes, do let's that. check it out. Hello, welcome to the 
Today on VCA 2024, it's the 10th edition and I'm live to bring you updates from the red carpet. Today, your favorites are here on the red carpet looking all dashing and I can't even wait to have a conversation with them. Want to see more? Follow me. I'm Jadel Simon. This is New Central. I've been saying this, that everyone likes to get a pat on the back. Everyone likes when there's some sort of incentive to your work. Now, doing, making a movie in Nigeria is really hard. I don't know anyone who has experienced or seen what it's like, but it's a lot of work. And getting a nomination that's saying you did something good enough for us to acknowledge it, and even now winning is the greatest incentive that exists. Let's take it back to when your first short film, right, was nominated for the AMVCA. How did you feel? To be honest, I just, I was so excited and I was just so thankful to God because people dream about these things and it takes some people like 10, 15 years to get there and being new in the industry, getting nominated, it's, it felt like God was just like picking me up and saying, I have you covered. I mean, this is 10 years. AMA was the only platform, or well, the most recognized pl platform before AMVCA. But the good, the thing, the, the, the good thing is AMVCA and Africa Magic, Mnet, have a platform that, you know, showcases a lot of the works and then they celebrate the work. So this is like a combo and it's no brainer. So I think that has really helped the industry to develop more. What is a category you think that the AMVCA is missing? Maybe a category for creatives. Maybe, because it's movies, movies, movies. This is also your first AMVCA. I want to genuinely know, how are you feeling? I am so excited because it's um, something that hasn't been done before and to be a trailblazer is truly amazing. You know, being the youngest ever best actor in the lead role. So how are you feeling as a nominee? Um, I feel recognized uh, for my work. I feel appreciated for the work that I did and I'm hoping for the best, made the best person for the award win. What does AMVC remind you? It reminds me of um, what we do and um, the fact that we recognize. It's like our own Oscars. So it's a case where we look forward to it. Big congratulations to all the winners as well as nominees. I mean, we can all agree that they've put out amazing projects in the past year as well as this year. So just being nominated for the AMVCA is already a huge feat. Guys, I indeed had an amazing time here at AMVCA 2024. Until next time, this is me signing out. I'm Jadel Simon. This is New Central. Jadel looking sharp right there on the red carpet. Yes, if I should say so myself. Looks like a hot stuff. Yes, yeah. and that was an amazing package there. You know how the AMV say when we had to bring you that back to back to back. And we still have our special guest with us in the studio. That's right. And the conversation is still lit. Yes, yes. I, I have to ask. So far, the 10th edition has come and gone. Yeah. What are we expect to see in following editions? You know, mm -hmm. that could make this bigger, better, and more inclusive. What are you mm -hmm. thinking? What we should see in the next Next, the next yeah. Season, number one. You should see me win. Yeah. <laughs> I like yeah, that. Yeah, yeah. Like, say that again. Say that again. Yeah. 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 That's good. So, That's good. Okay. Um, and it should be more exciting, I guess. Okay. More exciting, better movies. You know, because we just keep getting better. Yeah. better. I like that. Yeah. So yeah. Makes sense. Yeah, I'll, I'll also say the same. You know. You winning? We're, we're winning next year. <laughs> and. Um, the years after that, the years okay. after that. Yes, you know, you're going to get sick of us. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and also to see, you know, more creative works being pushed out there mm. because there's, there's a lot of great stuff. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of great stories. And I would also like to see, you know, projects that do not have the finances getting financed mm -hmm. for these projects mm -hmm. so that they are able to showcase the amazing, authentic African stories yeah. that they have in store. Yeah, yeah. yeah. makes sense. And, and, makes and sense. also, I would like to see more new faces win. Yes. Mm. yes more new faces win. Do yes, things, yes. Mm. I would also mm. love to see that. Definitely. Like, Everybody should be seen for their craft and work. Are you love are you trying to say that it's just old faces that are winning? Mm. Oh. No, I'm not trying to say that. Like <laughs> this this AMVC, I'm really glad. I felt seen nominated. Okay. I felt really seen and my colleague, like okay. I felt it was it was just beautiful seeing yeah. a lot of new faces seen. Yeah. So yeah, 
I want more of that in the next one. I think because they've already started with the 10th edition, you know, bringing yeah. in a nom uh, nominations uh -huh. you know, from the, the younger generation. It's, yeah. it's, it's good. So it's, it's good. beautiful. Now, okay. I ask this question a lot to people on the red carpet, you know, because Nollywood is it's bigger, it's better than mm -hmm. what we were used to. Yeah. But now, if we're trying to compete with Hollywood, I know you talked about, you know, more, more money. Yeah. 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 What, what, what would get us there? A whole lot. But I feel like we're on that road. Mm -hmm. We're on that process. We're not um, caught in corners. Mm -hmm. We're trying to make things excellent. We're trying to, if we want this straight, we want this straight. I think we're getting there. Yeah. I think more um, writers are putting in work. They're mm -hmm. pouring out their heart more. Mm -hmm. I feel like the directors are going in really they hard are. now. Mm -hmm. They're not caught in corners. Mm -hmm. So I feel like they're, they're, we're already on that path to greatness. So it's just... It might take a little bit of time, but we yeah. will definitely okay. get there. Yes. And, and speaking of speaking of um, wanting to be, you know, as good as them, I feel we need a whole lot of more collaboration. Mm -hmm. We need to ensure that, in as much as we want to be, you know, where they are, we do not lose our authentic nature. Yeah. Okay. You know, our African stories. So it's 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 collaborations mm -hmm. across. You know, to be, build that bridge. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and and I see it happening. You know, you have um, more Nigerians coming out and doing stuff in Hollywood. Yeah. And you know, we're heading there. Mm -hmm. And um, it is great to see because you see your person, and so you it's easy you to feel, relate. Yeah. Yes, you feel relate. You feel seen. You yeah. feel heard. So, yeah. So it's like okay. Let's be in more of theirs and let them be in more of ours. Mm -hmm. So that is coexistence. Mm -hmm. And then, you know, that way it's easier. Yeah. It's a symbiotic nature. I love it's that. Too. I love that. Because um, if you go on social media real quick, people are talking about if they want to compare Hollywood to Nollywood, uh -huh. their conversation is on scripting mm -hmm. majorly. So do you think our scripts are not where they should be? Compare. Or? They are not where they should be, but I feel like you can see that there is work to be there. That's work. Yeah. They're not they're not relaxing anymore. Mm -hmm. There is work to be there, and that's a really great step. Seeing that there is work to be there. Yeah, sure. and it's, yeah. it's it's not necessarily that our scripts are not at par with theirs. Mm -hmm. Their production level is on a different. It's on a, a costume, sound, exactly. huge Almost. budget. So <laughs> they have a big budget, budget to sponsor mm -hmm. these films. Yes. and even if it's a script that is not as good as. The ones we have, mm -hmm. you can see that it still does well because other factors come in: the yeah. marketing, the 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 costumes, mm -hmm. you know, the production quality yes. comes in, and that that helps boost up the 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 way it is perceived to yeah. the world. Yeah. So I I, I just feel um, we have scripting, but it can get better. Yeah, definitely. It can definitely, definitely and it will get it will better because we we're we're seeing it. It's 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 progressing. Well, on that road. It's progressing. <laughs> I can see. The main can see. The main <laughs> room, <you know? laughs> what can we say? Uh, All right. It's been an absolute pleasure having yeah. you. Before the award, we had spoken to both of you, and I know that we were hoping that you backed that award and brought it home, but I must still say a big congratulations to both Thank of you. you. Thank you. did an incredible it's job. So and like you said, who knows, next, next year? Oh, the yeah, year next after? Year. The year I, after, I, after? Yes. I'm, I'm glad because, because of this nomination, because it's a, it's a symbol of hope mm -hmm. to every young creative out there, mm -hmm. you know, to keep pushing, keep doing what you love and yeah. love what you do. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Don't let anybody tell you otherwise. Mm -hmm. You understand? But it's good to listen to reason, mm. but love what you do. Yeah. It, it helps you in the long run. Yeah. And, um, you know, just, just, just this quote. <laughs> you know, they say, um, shoot for the stars and you land on the moon. Mm. Nah. I say shoot for the galaxies and Ooh. be a one of the stars. Yeah. Mm. Yes. That's mm. what it hey. no small Preach! I, I'm, no I'm, small I, I want to yeah. drop my offering. <laughs> There's no better way Let to me drop off this mm. one. Just drop it. There's absolutely no better. Thank you again for being a part of the show. We do appreciate it. Hopefully, we'll talk about your more projects coming out yes, soon yeah, in the future. Lately. But it's been an absolute honor having you. It's been a pleasure, it's been guys. So beautiful. It's been a pleasure, guys. It's so beautiful. Thanks for coming out. Thanks for coming out. Thank you.